Maguire is going to kill it. Okay, excuse me. Chate Scott Martinez is going to go first, so go ahead and lead us off, Chate Scott. Thank you so much, everybody, for coming out today to support. Give a huge thank you to my co-plaintiffs, as well as the legal team that argued very eloquently on our behalf. Uh, a big thank you to the judge as well, the judge panel, uh, that heard our argument. Uh, my name is Chutez Catanatiu Martinez. Uh, I'm 18 years old. We filed this lawsuit a handful of years ago uh, alongside other Colorado residents that were very concerned about our community, our future, uh, and more so about the irresponsibility that we saw from uh, the state agency of the COGCC as well as our politicians here in the state of Colorado for their failure to adequately protect the health, our environment, the welfare of the peoples. When we look around uh, currently at the political state, I see many politicians, both Democrat and Republican, that are failing to adequately represent the voices and the best interests of our communities, of our people, as youth that are going to be inheriting the state, this country, and this land. It's our responsibility to stand here and hold those industries accountable, to hold our government and our politicians accountable, to hold these state agencies accountable for their actions, to ensure that we can really work together in collaboration with, uh, the, with the legal branch to help, uh, in, in hopes that they will help hold them accountable to protect and preserve the natural resources, to help protect and preserve our community and our people. You know, this is a much more than politics. This is much more than, than uh, profit. This is much more than climate or fossil fuels. This is about our future. This is about our planet, our people, our communities. And we are in a very pressing, uh, we are at a time where there's a lot of pressing urgency all around us. Um, and so I, I, I have a lot of trust and a lot of faith in our generation to come forth and, and bring forth the solutions that we need. And I feel very held by, you know, uh, all the adults and the elders in our community and our lives that are working and standing with us to fight for that change, to fight for that justice. The people that have come out today to support. I have a mad amount of gratitude for all of you, for my community, for coming up. And um, this is a, it's a long battle. It does not be, that does not end with uh, this hearing. It does not end with Prop 112. It does not end with, uh, you know, this is the continuation of something that has been going on for a very long time to fight the injustice of our systems. And we continue that today. So thank you all for coming out. And remember to play your part. Vote, do your thing. You know, we all have a part to play. So, thank you.